and must key, not must key as in stink key. No, no. Hey guys, Jess here. Welcome back to my channel. For those of you that are already a part of the family, I'd like to thank you very much. However, for those of you that are not yet a part of the fam life, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell as well. Today, we are going over scent combinations for the pomegranate scent. So without further ado, I will not hold you any longer. First things first is Dove's Body Polish. So this is in the pomegranate seeds and shea butter scent. Shea butter scent. I don't know what's going on with my pronunciation. But we're going to continue. <laughs> so the first step of scent combinations. It is to start with the foundation of what you want to smell like what you want to build upon. So this is a body scrub that we are starting with. And this is a regimen that I have done from time to time or when I want to change from what I normally use in my hygiene routine. The product profile of this is the texture is right in between. So it is gritty, but it's also moisturizing. It is not too thick. It is not too runny unless you let water run into the scrub which is almost inevitable while you're using it whether you're showering or whether you are bathing in the bathtub yes <laughs> when this product hits the skin it does melt i mean almost immediately it melts into your skin and the moisturization properties coming from the shea butter also it, it accompanies it complements the grittiness of the scrub therefore they wind up working together to exfoliate your skin really well it which basically is working together to smooth out the texture of your skin from maybe goosebumps maybe razor bumps to smooth as a baby's bottle and not to mention the scent long after you step out of that bathroom does linger and it is great to start with next up is victoria secrets dark peony fragrance lotion I felt like i said that too fast <laughs> so the next step in your scent combinations, you want to follow up with a lotion or a body cream to seal in the foundation of the scent that you started with in the first step. I've had this since last year and I did have the matching body mist, fragrance mist, potato, potato. Although the notes for this fragrance lotion are floral and musk key not must key as in stink key no no like there's a there's a note when that is a category of scents called musk and they fall underneath the category of that like woodsy scents these have floral notes these also have must key notes not as in stink keynotes yes uh, but it still gives off a very fruity scent at least to me and my senses and my sense of smell so this is a great compliment to follow up with right as you're out of the shower right as you're out of the tub to start with and it's a perfect compliment where it's just sweet enough to compliment the pomegranate from the dove body polish Next up is the Fireworks Body Mist. Body spray, potato, potato. Nope. Okay. The last step in your scent combinations for this pomegranate scent. You want to build upon the scent by finishing it off with a body mist 
Body spray, fragrance spray, potato, potato, tomato, tomato. Pretty much the same. When it comes to a body mist or anything in that category, the notes for this body mist are pretty much fruity and food based in nature. So we have strawberry, we have peaches, and we have vanilla. So those are combined three notes that are both fruity and food based or spice based. If you want to get technical about the vanilla that's in it, that's a spice that's used often in cooking. Also, this scent is a fresh breath of air and it's a great complement to a fruity scent that is acidic in nature. So I believe, and I'll put it at the bottom if I'm wrong, um, if I'm off track, I believe that pomegranate is a acidic type of fruit, much like oranges and tangerines and so forth. So for you to follow up with a body mist or spray in that category that is that has a sweet note to it to complement that sour smell. I don't want to say sour, wait. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Um, as a scent that smells acidic in nature, then you want to have something, a balance of sweet and sour, much like the sauce. I promise you I'm not trying to make you hungry. I'm trying not to. <laughs> You, you want to have something when you have your scent combinations, especially with the matter of any type of fruit-based hygiene product, to have a balance. They have this sauce called sweet and sour sauce. You want to mimic that in your scent combinations for your hygiene routine as well. So the fact that this contains notes, and I'm not sure... I'm not sure what scent it is. Maybe perhaps it's the strawberries. That's the sweet note. Um, peaches, I believe, are acidic in nature. Again, I will correct myself when I go back and edit this. Or maybe perhaps it's the vanilla note. But you want to have a balance of sweet and acidic. I don't want to say sour. Because, you know... Open yourself up, can of worms, all kinds of jokes, all kinds, yes. <laughs> and so the fact that this carries so much of a sweet note that is stronger than the other two, whether that's the strawberries or the vanilla, it will help balance out the acidic nature of the pomegranates. And then that will thus fill, it, it will thus finish off you intensifying the scent of pomegranates. And with a body mist, you're not going to overpower the scent. It's a mist. Perfumes are quite different. And I expressed that in, I believe, How to Smell Good All Day. And I will also, I'll just link you to the playlist. <laughs> also, you, you want it to be that way where no scent overpowers the other unless you want it to and you're heavy handed and you apply it as such. And that, ladies and gentlemen, are my scent combinations for the pomegranate scent. And until next time and until the next video. Mm -hmm.